Well, now that I just realized I spent like five minutes talking to a camera and did not start recording. Why does that keep happening to me? Anyway, what's up guys? Cardock, back again. Um, this time it's channel update. It is February 22nd, 2017. By the time you watch this, it'll probably be February 23rd or later. I don't fucking know. Anyway, I want to do a channel update. It's been a few weeks. I've got a lot of big stuff going on, so I wanted to, to kind of fill y'all in on the, the details. Um, so first off, games. New games, old games, whatever. Uh, first off, uh, Long Dark is going to become a series. Um, it's going to still be occasionally streamed, but it will become a series also. I'm going to try with the seven day, the seven day challenge that I did last time. Survive seven days on Interloper. Maybe longer if I can. Um, we're gonna that'll that'll begin not this week but next week. Um, I mean, it's pretty much just gonna be funny segments. Now, if I do manage to get a complete playthrough um, where I survive the full seven days, then I will. Uh, I don't know how long it's gonna take me to do this, but I am going to eventually survive at least seven days on interloper difficulty on the long dark because I'm a badass and that's what I do. Um, second off, Ark. I'm not certain I'm going to keep doing videos on Ark. Because it's not that I don't enjoy them. I know that y'all, I love playing Ark. Don't get me wrong. And it's not that y'all don't like it. It's just that I don't like playing for an hour, two hours, and then spending the next four editing it back down. Because there's so much grinding, but... I have to go through every single fucking minute of the footage. And if I go through every single fucking minute of the footage, that takes for fucking ever. And it's annoying. So, good chance that Ark will be going bye-bye. Um, if I can get more people to play it, or maybe I'll start using that as the live stream, I don't know. Now, speaking of the live stream, onto my... Oh, wait. Actually, the big announcement. Well, I kind of already announced it, but unless you were there for the live stream, you probably didn't see it, because there's no way in hell someone sat through eight hours. That bullshit. Um, Subnautica is coming to the channel. So, I've been watching Subnautica for months and months and months on end. I first watched it with IGP. Now, IGP, I feel like, like don't get me wrong, Markiplier, PewDiePie, all the big fucking names of YouTube have played the game. I didn't find it through them. I found it through IGP because I felt, and watching, because I've watched various YouTubers now play this game, and I've come to realize that IGP is just more fucking into it. Like, he, 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 he gets much more excited about playing the game than these other guys do. Well, I don't know. It's probably a close tie between him and Markiplier. I get, I get different ends of the spectrum with, with him and Markiplier, so, yeah. Um, anyway, so... I saw him playing it. I've been watching him play it. I've been following the updates from his stuff, and I finally decided, you know what, fuck it. I want to play this game. I'm, I've been, I've been, I've been keeping an eye on it. Now, I don't know a lot about the crafting. I don't know a lot about, you know, how to make it better or more fun or easier to use or anything like that. I know the storyline though, so y'all won't get to see my shock and awe or anything that has been in game as far as the story goes up until the release of this video. Now, anything after, of course, I'm assuming eventually you get rescued, you figure out how, or that, or you figure out how to flourish. One of the two. You either survive long enough or you flourish. It's one of the two. Who knows? But, um, anyway. Okay, so that's all for the games. Now, point two. Live streaming. Sorry about time. <laughs> live streaming. I noticed, and I've spoken with a few of you and a few people on the outside about my live streams, and it seems like I get a lot of good response from that. So I'm going to start live streaming more frequently. Now here's the caveat: live streams will be happening twice a week now, Wednesday and Sunday. However, the Wednesday one will be on Twitch, at least until I can afford to get the um, the restream. Pro or whatever the fuck it's called where you can stream to both YouTube and Twitch. Now once I do that, obviously it'll be twice a week that I'll be streaming. Um, the Twitch stream is going to be more of indie games. The more the 
Well, truth be told, the, the, the streams are going to be random as fuck. I'm going to shoot for more indie games. And that's honestly, that's probably where ARK's going to wind up being, is on Saturday streams. Or on Sunday streams. Twitch I'm going to use for, I don't know, maybe progression of a story and some story-based game. Or, you know, so y'all can watch me grind away and understand what I have to go through just to put out a 25-minute video to y'all. Who knows? I don't know what the streams are going to consist of. Maybe I'll just sit there and fucking talk. Who knows? Um, anyway... So yeah, there will be more frequent streams. There will be on Wednesday and on Sunday on Twitch. Now my Twitch name, and there will be a link. Uh, there will be a link for it in the description below, as well as um, I'll put a link every every Wednesday on Twitter. The Twitch name is Cardock two two one YT. Um, that's where that's my profile on there. That's where I will begin streaming. Now that's out of the way. I want to fully and officially announce I do have a Patreon account now. I am not a big YouTuber. I don't think I... And it's not even something I built built because I need it. My thought process on this is... And maybe I'm naive or wrong or stupid about how YouTube works. My thought process on this is... Each month I'm buying some other fucking item to kind of improve how I do YouTube. As a matter of fact, most of my tax return, if it doesn't go towards a trip and a concert, is actually going to go towards me building a second computer. And the second computer is going to, that and an Elgato, is going to be used for strictly gaming. So this one's going to get cleaned out. The one I've got now is going to get cleaned out and is going to be turned into a um, editing machine because it's a dual processor computer. So it's way better at handling rendering than a single processor which would be better for gaming um, anyway um, so yeah I'm planning on building a computer a new computer which there will be a build log for um, I bought this microphone a couple months ago I'm planning on getting a boom for it so that it can sit up here and actually pick up my voice better I'm getting a camera on the first that I can it's a mobile platform for different and more interesting content uh, there, there's a whole shit ton of stuff that I feel like I could use to improve the quality of my channel. Now, where I'm at right now, I can keep on indefinitely making gaming videos. I can do it forever. I've got OBS to, I've got OBS. I'm gonna build a gaming computer regardless. I don't give a shit what anyone says. I'm building a fucking gaming computer because I want one, damn it. I want to be able to play fucking Battlefield in 4K or whatever it is. Um, but anyway, the idea behind the Patreon is two things. First of all, I think if I'm getting enough kickback from the people that watch me, they think, you know what, I really want to help this guy make more content, more interesting content, different stuff, then you'll, you know, help me out, whether it be it by like a monthly fucking whatever, monthly contribution of a dollar, two dollars, five dollars, whatever, or if it's a one-time donation of like, you know, 15 bucks or some shit like that, whatever it is, any little bit will help, it's not, obviously it's not a requirement, um, quite frankly, the main thing that you get from subscribing, and there are, like, I made the tiers and everything the fuck else. If you've ever used Patreon, you understand what I'm talking about. If not, go to my page, at least look at the fucking thing. But, I, um, I built it to improve the content. Now, a portion, and you'll see it on each of my set goals that I have, portion of every bit of the money that's going to come from YouTube, Patreon, and my own pocket, the money I make every month anyway, all is going to charities. Now, they might not be charities that you necessarily know about or support, but they're charities that I fucking support, and I would like to think that most of the people that watch me are kind of in the same mindset that I am. Um, if you want more information for it, go to the Patreon page and at least look at the fucking thing. You don't have to contribute, like, I, I'm, either way, I'm still donating money, because... I'm going to do that to these charities. And either way, I'm going to still slowly begin to buy the things that I want to buy and build the things that I want to build and do the things I want to do to increase, uh, to improve the content. But it's going to take a much longer time if I don't have any help. So, there's that. Um, I wanted to also, and this is going to be the last point, I also wanted to send out thank yous to three people in particular. I'll start with just my entire subscriber base, um, and, and, and my viewers too, like, you guys are the fucking shit, okay, 
y'all are the, the little bit of interaction that I get with y'all and I'm hoping that that increases over time I, I, I love it I love talking and getting feedback and, and even if it's not feedback like I talked to one guy about just random per, somewhat personal not super personal but somewhat personal things you know I, I like I like being able to talk to people and I, the people that are watching all of the videos that are watching my videos that are joining me for the live streams, they're commenting on stuff, even if it's just a leaving a like or fucking saying something on Twitter, whatever. You people are really, really making me happy. Like, I, I, I cannot begin to express my gratitude for y'all. Um, that, that goes out to just anyone who watches my videos, whether you're subscribed or not. Although if you're not, I mean, hey, if you liked it once, there's more to come. So, But, um, now... As far as the personal thank you goes, first of all, uh, Stephanie Satellite. I'm not her last name because you know privacy and whatnot. But she developed my logo. She has and either made my thumbnails or taught me how to do things to make the thumbnails of my videos. She's featured. Obviously, she's been in all my Minecraft videos, and that was more something we just started doing. And I was like, hey, can I record this? Um. She's moderating my fucking live stream. She's going to moderate my Twitch live stream, too, until I figure out how the fuck to use ModBot. But anyway, she is literally my right-hand woman and the, the part of the backbone of what I'm doing right now. So I, I, I want to let all of y'all know, and her especially, and she already knows, but I'm going to say it out here where everybody can fucking hear it. Thank you. You don't realize how much you mean to... The, just this portion, just this, how much you mean to it. But um, second off, um, and dude, I'm so sorry if I'm butchering your name. Tyler Do Daughtry, Daughtry, Do Do I don't know. I think you actually told me how to pronounce it. I'm such a piece of shit. I completely forgot how to. Say it. Anyway, Tyler, dude, you're awesome. Um, you regularly are interacting with me on my videos. You regularly interact with me in the comments. And when you notice I didn't put up a few vi videos for a few days. You actually checked on me. Like, dude, you're, you're fucking awesome. Thank you so much for that. I, I cannot begin to tell you how much I appreciate that. Like, it, it's cool because, you know, it reminds me that, that I get to be a real person. It reminds me that there's real people watching me. And it reminds me that just as much as I care about any damn other body else walking down the street, y'all care about me too. So it, that's that helps. Thank you. And third of all, I cannot remember your last name, but I saw you on the live stream last Sunday. Um... I remember your first name, Mardek. Dude, you are a huge help for fucking <laughs> the long dark. Like, I can directly attribute me surviving as long as I did on that last section of the play of the of the live stream. I can directly attribute how long I survived to that. So thank you so much for, for your help and, and for all your all the all the information you did give me. Um, I know that you, you, you were worried about your English speaking or worried about spamming or anything like that, but dude, you are more than welcome to show up, talk all you want. I, I can look past some bad English. I mean, fuck, I was in, I've been in customer service or patient relations for the last nine, no, decade. Literally, last ten years I've been working in customer service or patient relations in some capacity. Uh, about half and half, actually. So yeah, I'm not worried about bad English or anything the fuck else. Dude, keep, keep coming up and... and, and, and fucking giving, giving me information, feedback, whatever it is. Um, Alright, so I'm going to quit being a fucking bleeding heart. Thank y'all so much for everything that you do. Thank you for watching. And